My favourite story photographically and visually, it changes, but I think I do love the one of Previsor because there's a lot of water in that picture and it's quite, funny enough, it was beginning of January, you know, mm. which you think, what, what terrible weather might you have in January? But actually it's the best weather because there are these few days in January that are called the halcyon days when the weather can just suddenly be like spring and then it stops again and goes back to being a bit more wintry. But the lighting and the, the sort of the blueness of those shots and all the, the sea and yeah. that, I just loved um, the way you've done that as well. It's a very sort of light, it's quite an optimistic story in its dark way. It is, it? yes, and I think, I, I love that story. I, I, I really like the way that the images work in that because the images, I mean, that's a, a really good example of one that where the images actually don't tell the story as such. They, they complement it in a really clear way, but there's nothing actually obvious to tell you that, that the people that are in those pictures are the ones you're describing in, in the story at all. But they just perform a really nice narrative complement to the, to the text.